Hello, hello. I can't hear you very well. Perhaps this banana will work better. No, really, the inspiration for LG's new G Flex smartphone, which went on sale in the US and Europe this week, was the curved displays that made their debut in big screen TVs last year, rather than bananas. The G Flex is the world's first flexible curved big screen smartphone. But does this new phablet deliver real benefits or is it just technology for technology's sake? I've been testing the G Flex for the past week and I found the curved screen good for watching YouTube clips and Netflix movies and the self-healing case designed magically to repair minor scratches is an interesting innovation. Among its other strengths, the G Flex is fast, has good battery life, and includes a new feature for LG, the ability to split the screen and run two apps at once. But these positives are offset by other factors, including the sheer size of the handset, which makes it difficult to hold comfortably, and a screen resolution that's not as good as rival handsets, like Samsung's Galaxy Note 3. I've also found the unusual position of the power and volume buttons on the rear of the device inconvenient, and I've been disappointed by the sound quality, factors that, together with the relatively high price tag, prevent me from wholeheartedly endorsing the G-Flex. Nevertheless, I actually like LG's G-Flex more than I expected to, even though I'm not convinced its new features, like the flexible curved screen, are actually that compelling. For the money, I'll stick with my Samsung Galaxy Note 3 with its brighter, higher definition screen, up-to-date operating system, and slightly more manageable size for my relatively small hands.